is going to be a makeup tutorial on this look. It's a very simple everyday kind of look. Um, I made it a little bit more glam though with some false lashes. It's mainly focusing on perfected skin and then really neutral on the eyes, neutral lips. So I hope you guys enjoy and if you want to see how I got this look, then please keep watching. So I'm going to start out by priming my skin using the Hourglass Veil Mineral Primer and just massage that into my skin. Then for foundation, I'm mixing the Too Faced Born This Way foundation with a couple of drops of Cover Effects Custom Cover Drops just to adjust the colour and the coverage. Onto the eyes, I'm first priming my eyelids using my MAC Painterly Paint Pot just to create a smooth base. And then for today's eyeshadows, I'm using mainly Colourpop, so I'm going in with Glow, which is from Kathleen Light's Where the Light Is palette. And I'm just applying this as my brow bone highlight. Then taking Cornelius, which is a deep sort of matte brown shade, I'm just going to buff that into the crease using a Real Techniques domed shadow brush. Then going in with this light bronzy shimmery shade, I'm just applying this all over the lid. It's not overly pigmented, but it just gives a nice sheen to the eyelid. And then I'm going in with a slightly golder shimmery shade. I'll have the names listed down below and I'm just applying this to the outer third of the eyelid using my finger. Then I'm going to just tight line my eyelids using my Eye of Horus eyeliner and I'm going to apply a thin um, line of that along my top lash line. Then I'm just going to curl my lashes and apply some mascara. This one's the MAC in Extreme Dimension. Then I'm going to conceal my under eyes using my Maybelline Instant Age Rewind. So I'm just popping some underneath the eyes and then blending everything out with a damp beauty blender. Then to conceal the rest of the face and highlight, I'm just using my Maybelline Fit Me Concealer and I'm placing this all down the center of my face, on my chin, on the high points of my cheeks and then underneath where I'm going to contour. And then I'm using the Cryolan Combi Foundation and I'm using the dark shade just to cream contour my face. So I'm applying this with a flat foundation brush and then I'm going to go ahead and blend everything out using my Beauty Blender once again. So you want to blend out your, don't mix the darker areas into the center of the face. Then to bronze up the skin, I'm using my MAC MSF Natural in Dark Deepest and I'm just using a tulip brush from Models Prefer and I'm just buffing this all over the areas where I've contoured. Then I'm going to bake my under eyes and underneath my contour, so I'm just taking this Face of Australia Loose Translucent Powder and I'm applying a nice amount of that to my under eyes and underneath my contour and then I let that bake for like 5 minutes-ish and we do a little dance. And then I'm going to apply my blush while I wait, so I'm using MAC Melba Blush which is a beautiful like peachy pinky sort of shade. Then you just want to dust off all the excess powder. I'm just using a contour brush to do this. Um, you just want to use a fluffy kind of brush. And then you're left with a nice clean contour. And then I'm just going to set the rest of the center of my face using my MAC Neuralize Skin Finish in Light Plus. Then to highlight, I'm using MAC Soft and Gentle. I didn't realize how MAC heavy this was. Um, and I'm just going to apply this to the tops of my cheekbones, um, the center of my face, and just all the areas where I want to look glowy. Then once the base is done, I'm just going to set it with my Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. And then moving back onto the eyes, I'm taking Cornelius again on the same brush and just buffing this quite messily underneath the lower lash line. Then going in with the goldy shade, I'm just going to use my finger to blend that underneath the eye as well. And then just using my brush to buff everything out. And then for an inner corner highlight, I chose MAC Nylon, which as per usual, it's my favorite inner corner highlight. And I'm just going to pop that right in the inner corners and I'm using a fairly big amount because I wanted it to be nice and bright. Then I'm applying some false lashes. These ones are the Red Cherry 747Ms. 
um, and they're just nice and natural lashes. Then just apply some bottom lash mascara and then for the lips I used a nude lip liner from the makeup store. I'll have the name listed down below again and I just outlined my entire lips and then I went ahead and filled them in with Gerard Cosmetics lipstick in Rodeo Drive. And after that the look is complete. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!